Louisiana Beer Reviews, Monterey Beer, Alvarado Street Brewery, Brewery, Salinas, California. This was sent to me by Guy. He sent me two tall can IPAs also and another can of this. Thank you. Now, Jean, thank you, Guy. Jean and I, Jean Pierre, and I did uh, do a review of this and we were, you know, pleased with it. So I'm doing a solo. The can is showing different scenes that you would encounter in California, like an old tourist brochure, some of which I own. Um, they're saying they're basing this on an old 1930s recipe. It's 4.5% uh, alcohol. Don't know if it's sold in bottles. I know it's sold in cans and draft. But there is one other video review for this, and they, they were pleased with it, very pleased. So I had to reshoot this guy some, I, because I had some production problems, but it was a thick head, and it was crackling, but that died away. You see there's not a lot of lacing. And I was remarking how it was similar to like a um, Milwaukee's Best Premium. And they used to have that 4.3% uh, 4 .4, version. And then I was thinking, well, maybe it's like Schaefer it used to be. Yeah, 4.6% Schaefer I used to get in the 90s. So uh, I, was talking, they, they, I was talking about how the company says it's made with two-row American barley malt. They don't mention the, the hops. Do they use adjuncts? They don't say. I wouldn't be shocked, but uh, that's no big deal. Uh, it's hazy. Can't see through the glass, really. And it's straw. Look how light. Look at that light straw appearance. See the aroma? You get yeasty barley malt, cracker, biscuit, and then the flavor. And then the body's going to be light to medium and a crisp finish. It's mild, mellow. I would consider it more of a premium lager than an American light lager, though. That usually go above 4.2, you into the premium. Not really light beer. It's kind of plain. You say, I know you, you might say, well, a lot of American mass-produced beers are plain and bland. Okay, fine. I agree with that. But I can get some of those for $8.99, a 15-pack. I don't know if I can get this for that price. Now, I would buy it for that price, you know, comparable price. I just noticed a lot of craft beer lagers are, um, and there's many around here. They sort of mimic the American adjunct style, like Founders, Solid Gold, and all that. But the price would be double, so you, the payout doesn't match the uh, return, you know what I'm saying? What you get doesn't match what you're paying. That's just my complaint, but... That's interesting to try it at least. So I would still score it a B plus, 88 out of 100. But then on the other hand, I score many American adjunct loggers B plus, A minus. So got to take that into account. Anyway, laissez les bon temps relay. Sorry about the production issue, but that happens sometimes. So good product, very good product. And I'm going to end this review by saying, y'all come on, y'all come on down to southeastern Louisiana.